I leave my family here with you. The time they start having babies, I'll be a, a thousand miles gone. And I see you. Still a massa. I die every day. But when George and Matilda have children, if you ever touch just one, I'll kill you. And that was a clip of Tony Award-winning actress Anika Noni Rose starring as Kizzy in Roots, a new television miniseries premiering Memorial Day on the History Channel. The original Roots series, based on the book by Alex Haley, was a national television event when it aired on ABC in 1977, earning nine Emmys, a Golden Globe, and a Peabody Award. Joining us to talk about this and more is Anika Noni Rose. Welcome, Anika. So great Thank to have you, you here. Thank you. Good morning. The original Roots was such a national event. Mm -hmm. And now this one. Are there any of these same players involved in this production? Well, LeVar Burton is one of our producers um, who played the original Kunta Kinte. Uh, Mark Wolper is the son of the original producer. Um, so we've got those two people with us. Uh, as far as actors, we don't have any of the original cast that I know of. Right, um, right. That I'm aware of. Right. So, um, but well, LeVar really Burton lucky. became, I mean, his name became a household name yes. after Roots aired. It started yes. such an important dialogue at the time. Do you think that dialogue is just as important now? Absolutely. I think it's just as important. I think that, um, I think it's very, that we've been lulled into a very dangerous place of thinking that um, that we have come a lot farther than we have. Mm -hmm. And I think that, you know, now with the advent of social media, we are able to see a lot of injustice that's going on in this country that we just didn't know about um, because we didn't have the tools to have them at our fingertips all of the time. So. Now that we know and now that we're seeing more and more, I think it's a very poignant time for this to be back and we be able to talk about the formation of this country and us, the heritage of us as Americans and our relationships to each other. Absolutely, in our shared history. Mm -hmm. Now you play Kizzy. In so many ways, she's the heart of the story. Mm -hmm. What did you do to prepare for your role? I reread the book. Mm -hmm. I um, read a, uh, or listened to a lot of slave narratives. I um, read. Uh, I read a lot of slave narratives, and and I visited a plantation um, in, in not in, in New Orleans, but outside of New Orleans, called the can't think of the name of the plantation, but it's the only plantation in the United States that tells the story of the enslaved persons from their viewpoint. Incredible. Um, and it is a phenomenal place to visit and to really take in. They have what I call our Wailing Wall, mm -hmm. and it has the names of all of the slaves that passed through that plantation engraved on the wall with parts of their stories, and the Garden of Angels, which is dedicated to the over 2,000 children who were lost Amazing. on that plantation. It's it's phenomena. And phenomenal. what do you think of Kizzy? What what is it that drives her? What is what is at the core of Kizzy? Survival. Um, and I think that's not enough. So love, mm -hmm. because she was very loved growing up. She was very lucky to be raised by both of her parents, although in a very unfortunate situation. Um, and she has a very strong faith, uh, all handed down to her from her parents. So she has these things that she wants to imbue within her child so that he knows his heritage, knows that he is a man regardless of what the country and, and the people around him are trying to make him and telling him that he is, um, and to be someone who also can survive and pass this information on. She is so strong, and we cannot wait to see you play her on Memorial Day. Thank you. Anika Noni Rose, thanks so much for coming to see us. Thank you.